and welcome back to the channel. Check out where I am today. Oh yes, this is the Four Seasons Resort in Costa Rica. Oh, this place, guys, it's really touched my heart. It's so grounding, it's so humbling, and check out this view. I mean, absolutely unbelievable. And today, we are gonna feel the burn from head to toe. We're gonna work those glutes, we're gonna work those abs. So make sure you subscribe to the channel, you check out the Four Seasons Costa Rica, all the details in the description below, and we are gonna get started. Okay, so we are gonna start off with a nice wide squat, and we are just gonna pulse it down. So we're gonna do three little pulses, and then squeeze those glutes at the top. So knees out to the side, and then all the way up. I'm gonna get you through this whole workout today so you don't have to go anywhere. All you've gotta do is focus and keep on pushing through. We're gonna get to the end and that's where those results are once you've got all the way through, all the way up. So we're gonna do an exercise for 30 seconds. You're gonna have a 10 second rest and we're gonna add on new exercises. So this is our first one, take it down and release. Okay, shake out those legs, 10 seconds. We're gonna do that all over again, those 30 seconds, and then we're gonna add on another exercise. So, down we go. One, two, three, and then squeeze those glutes. Now push those knees out to the side for me. Keep those shoulders away from the ears. Keep your chest lifted. Give me a smile because we are gonna feel that burn and you're gonna feel so great. Exercise releases endorphins, it gives you adrenaline, and you're just gonna feel so amazing once you've got through it. Okay, little pulses all the way up. We're gonna take it one, two, three, and squeeze. That's it, one, two, three, all the way up. Okay, next exercise. We're gonna take it into a curtsy lunge and add the pulse. So you're gonna take it back, a little pulse, and then up to the top. Let's take it away. Whoo! So we're gonna feel that burn, guys, so make sure that you hashtag, I can feel the burn, Rebecca, so we can find all of those magical before and after photos, you guys feeling great, getting your sweat on. Keep that chest lifted for me, and take it nice and low. Use those glutes, guys. Wake up those legs and breathe. 10 seconds, you got this. We're gonna go back into those squats. Give me one more either side, all the way, and release. Okay, shake out those legs. We can do this. We're gonna take it nice and wide back into those pulses. So pushing those knees out to the side, hands together, and let's take it away. So one, two, three, and squeeze those glutes. That's it, chest is lifted. I'm just breathing in and out and making sure that it's happening. All the way up to the top, take three nice little pulses. You can do this. Halfway there, keep that chest up and squeeze those glutes. Can you feel those inner thighs, right? I know, they're on fire. That's the point, guys. You're gonna be able to get those great results if you keep on going. Envision what you want your body to look like and let's get there. Last one and squeeze. Okay, we're gonna take it into those reverse curtsy lunges, okay? Take a breath and let's go. Little pulse. Now, if you don't wanna add that pulse in today, maybe you're just not feeling it, that's okay. My goal here is to get you to move your body. Moving your body every day, even if it's just for 10 minutes. Even if you just put one of these videos on and 10 minutes, you feel the burn with me here in the middle of Costa Rica. Not bad, right? What a way to start your day. Okay, we're gonna add on that next exercise. Come all the way down. Lift up, keep going. Give me one more either side and all the way down. Okay, so we're gonna come down onto the ground. We're gonna work those inner thighs. So you're gonna push down with your feet onto the ground and then you're just gonna pulse in and out. Oh yeah, you are gonna feel this one guys because your legs are already on fire from those curtsy lunges. So push those hips nice and high up to the sky. Release your head down, relax your shoulders. Give me a smile because it's always so much better when you've, when you've got a smile on your face. That's it, bring those knees in, keep those feet flat on the ground, and breathe. Pulse for five, four, three, two, one. And gently roll all the way up. We're gonna come back into those wide squats. So remember, pushing those knees out to the side, shoulders away from those ears, and let's pulse for two, and then all the way up. Now I want you guys to squeeze your glutes all the time. If you're in the grocery store, squeeze your glutes. If you're waiting in line, if you're hanging out with friends, like that's how you're gonna grow your glutes is keeping your body engaged. Chest lifted and then all the way up. 
Who can remember the sequence so far? Yes, we're doing this. We're gonna do five exercises, guys. So we've done three. We're gonna add on two more. Bring it all the way up to the top. Take it down one more time and lift. Okay, shake out those legs and we're gonna take it into those curtsy lunges. Keep going, guys. If you're thinking right now, oh, I don't know if I can keep going. The answer is yes. If you think you can, if you think you can't, you're right. So the goal is to keep on going. Even if you just wanna step side to side, I want you to keep having that adrenaline to move your body to get those results. Take it down. Good work, everybody, halfway there. We're gonna take it back down into those bridge pulses. Give me three more on each side. All the way down, little pulse. Chest is up and shoulders are down and release those legs. Okay, let's take it down to the ground. We're gonna add on another exercise after these bridge pulses. So release all the way down nice and gently and let's go up and squeeze in and out. That's it, always really trying to push your hips up to the sky, releasing those shoulders, relax those hands, either palms up or palms down. If you want to, just, just go into a bridge. Or option number two, you can go up and down. Anything you wanna do, I just want you to keep moving because that's how you're gonna get those results. We're not gonna get results by sitting around. We just gotta keep moving. Breathe and release. Okay, next exercise we're gonna add on is we're gonna add on a high plank. Or you can take it in a low plank. High plank option one, low plank option number two. So remember, head is in line with our hips. That's in line with our heels. So pull those abs in, pull your belly button in towards your spine and we're just gonna hold it here, yes. And then we've only got one more exercise to add on after this, and we're gonna run through it all the way backwards and then you are complete. So know that we are almost there. We are almost through the workout and you can decide right now if you're gonna finish it. So make that decision to reward yourself with a workout and release down and standing all the way up to the top and then we're gonna take it all the way again. So pushing those knees out to the side, Get focused and let's go. Squeeze those glutes. Remember, 20% is the fitness, 80% is the nutrition, is what you eat, and 100% is your mindset. So right now, as your body starts to get a little bit tired, reframe your thinking. Just imagine, right, this is the first time that you've done these squats. You know, this is the first workout of the day and just reprogram yourself to say, right, I'm gonna start again, I'm gonna get all the way through, all the way up. Chest lifted and breathe. Okay, shake those legs out. I know we're getting that inner thigh burn today. Right, we're gonna take it into those curtsy lunges, one of my favorites, so let's take it away. Add that little pulse in if you want to. Get nice and low and taking it across. That's it, you got this. Just envision what it is that you want your body to get like and then we're gonna work towards it. Every single day counts, every single day. Halfway there. Keep that chest lifted for me. Everything nice and controlled. We don't need to go fast. We just need everything to be controlled. Give me one more and release. Okay, down onto the ground. We are going to whew, just breathe in, roll all the way down, pushing those feet down onto the ground and let's squeeze and bring those knees in. That's it, nice and gentle, everything in just working order, we're not pushing ourselves, we're not going crazy, you know, a lot of times we get so excessive with the exercise that we have to like really push it, when often it's about being slow and controlled. So relax those shoulders on the ground, push those hips nice and high to the sky, ah, give yourself a little bit of a smile, and let's keep it going for three, two, one, release all the way down, and take it over onto our front. Remember, into that plank. However which way that you'd like to do it, I'm gonna take mine down to the ground today. And if you wanna add on something, you can rock forwards and backwards. You can even dip side to side if you really wanna work those obliques. And this way it's gonna work a little bit more of those lower abs. So pull that belly button in towards the spine. Ooh, and you can hold it here. Maybe you wanna hold there for five seconds and then bring it forwards and backwards, add in some side dips. Whatever keeps you motivated, whatever keeps you going, that's what I want you guys to do. So the next exercise, we're gonna work our arms and release. So what we're gonna do is flip over. Your hands are gonna be directly underneath your shoulders. 
you're gonna push all the way up and we're gonna slowly take it down and then extend those arms. So it's really important here, we're not moving our hips, we are only moving those elbows. So slowly down and then push into the ground all the way up. Down we go and extend. Oh yeah, you got this guys. Keep on pushing through. We're doing so good. You can make it happen. 10 seconds left. And then we're gonna go all the way through, starting with these dips and then taking it all the way back to those squats and release down. Okay, give those arms a little bit of a shake. Take a big breath in together. Inhale through the nose and exhale out through the mouth. Let's put those hands up we go and squeeze and push. That's it, keep your elbows nice and narrow so that they're going straight out and then push down into the ground. Extend, and let's go. You can do this, halfway there. The last time you're gonna be doing these tricep dips, so keep on going, stay strong. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, release those arms, flip over onto your front, and we're gonna take it into that low plank. So all the way back, we're gonna get those hips in line with the heels, in line with the head, and then hold here. That's it, and just breathe. Inhale through the nose, <sighs> exhale it out, that's it. Nice and tight, hold that core steady by pulling your belly button in towards your spine, squeeze your glutes, and we're gonna take it into those bridge pulses in about 10 seconds. So keep holding here, keep breathing for me. Take a moment to reset your brain, reset that mindset and release. Flip it all the way over. We're gonna go into those bridge pulses. Guys, we've got like a minute and a half left. You can do this, don't give up now. Push those hips up to the sky and let's get going. Squeeze in and out. That's it, release those hands down to the side, release your jaw, no tension in your neck, and you're just bringing your knees in and then back out to parallel. Working those inner thighs. Oh yes, guys, I can feel the burn. I can definitely feel the burn. Let's keep it going. You've only got like a minute left. You can do this, keep pushing through. Push those hips up a little bit higher and release down, stand all the way up and we're gonna take it into those curtsy lunges. So give it a little bit of a shake. We've just got one minute to go. Let's take it over to that left side. So little pulse down and all the way up. That's it, chest lifted. Woo, give me a smile. You're like, yes, I'm so nearly done. I did this workout. Like, how are you gonna feel? You're gonna feel so proud of yourself because you did it, because you decided. And guys, it's not about being stuck. If you feel stuck, it's just because you haven't taken that first step forward. Take that first step, take that leap. All the way, last side, and release. Okay, last exercise. I'm gonna take it nice and wide. Let's get even lower in those squats this time. So, push out those knees, and let's take it down. One, two, three, and squeeze those glutes. That's it, you can do this. I want you to get a little bit lower than you did the time before, so really push those knees out, keeping that chest lifted, sink a little bit lower in those hips, and lift everything up, and keep breathing, you can do this. It's in there, guys. Keep staying strong, all the way to the top, keep squeezing those glutes, push those knees out to the side, all the way. Let's do one more, give an extra pulse at the bottom, and squeeze all the way to the top. Oh my goodness, guys, you crushed it. What a great workout. Well, make sure you subscribe to the channel so that you can see more of our amazing workouts. I'm so blessed to be here in Costa Rica at the Four Seasons. Check out all the details on their website. Guys, my name's Rebecca Louise. I'll see you on our next workout. Stay strong.